Conchana Farrow acted on stage and television for decades. She was best known for going toe-to-toe -to -toe with John Cryer and Charlie Sheen on the hit sitcom Two and a Half Men. We learned today that Farrell has died at the age of 77. Entertainment guru George Pinocchio joins us live from home with a look back at a life well-lived and such a funny woman. George? Absolutely. Ellen, David, I was just a kid the first time I saw Conchata Farrell on television. She was so memorable and so good that I always loved it whenever I saw her on TV or in a movie. So I was really thrilled when she got that role that truly changed her life. Look what the cat dragged in. He didn't just drag it. He ate it, pooped it out, and then covered it with sand. Conchata Farrell sure could deliver a punchline. As the outspoken housekeeper Berta on Two and a Half Men, she was a wealth of double entendres for years. I hear you've been sinking your putts on the company golf course. Farrell was an award-winning stage actress in New York when she won a role on TV in 1975. She starred in Hot L Baltimore, Norman Lear's short-lived series based on the off-Broadway play. The following year, there she was, featured alongside Faye Dunaway in the Oscar-nominated Best Picture Network. And long before she played a housekeeper on Two and a Half Men, she played one opposite Rip Torn in the 1979 film Heartland. In your letter, you said $7 a week. In Denver, I got $1.80 a day just for washing. Farrell worked with Julia Roberts and Aaron Brockovich. More than a decade earlier, she was her boss in Mystic Pizza. We have the real thing right here, the Mystic Pizza. Farrell also acted with Johnny Depp in the Tim Burton classic Edward Scissorhands. On TV, she was nominated for an Emmy, playing attorney Susan Bloom on L.A. Law. Well, I never thought I had a chance. <laughs> Life's full of surprises, even for an old broad like me. Years later, she told me a story about attending the Emmys for that L.A. Law nomination. The uh, paparazzi asked me to move aside so they could take a picture of the pretty ladies coming behind. I swear. <laughs> when she returned for one of her two nominations for Two and a Half Men, she dazzled with some loving guidance from the show's costume designer. And this is what she did for me, and she got my shoes and my earrings, because I don't do glamour. Her L.A. Law character might argue that. Farrell's Two and a Half Men co-star John Cryer shared this on social media today. She was a beautiful human. Berta's gruff exterior was an invention of the writers. Chatty's warmth and vulnerability were her real strengths. I'm crying for the woman I'll miss and the joy she brought to so many. And in a tweet, Charlie Sheen called her an absolute sweetheart, a consummate pro, and a genuine friend. And I would add to that a true original. Live from home, George Pinocchio, ABC 7 Eyewitness News. Now had, back to you. We had no idea she was so prolific, too. She's been around wow. forever oh. and what a fantastic career, George. Right, George, thank you.